Hi everybody, I'm Captain Floofers. And I'm Sorlin Greg. And welcome back to uh, Link's Awakening, and we last left off... An old man was asking about our stick. Yeah, so let's, let's, let's let him borrow. Let's let him borrow our stick. I like how we just kind of... Sorry. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I like how much more, much more detail there is. Yes, it is. It's, it's like, instead of him just kind of like hitting with the stick, he, he just pokes it. And now you get the honeycomb. Why was he poking a honeycomb with a stick? Can't you also get the stick back yourself now? No. You don't he need took the anymore. stick with him? Yeah. You're not sure how it happened, but take it. Um, were you asleep? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, oh, whoops. That's okay. Uh, sorry. We'll go back in. Didn't mean to eat your daughter. Sorry. Big greens of salt are made under. <laughs> that was a reference to a different, different let's play. It no, was also not, Zelda. We're not going to see King King Milton in this. We're not going to see. There's, yeah, there's, there's, there's no, no Zoras in this game, are there? There are Zoras. They're just enemies. Oh, yeah. There's the old, like, old school Zoras. Yes. Before they had legs and got married. <laughs> Back before we decided Zoras were people. <laughs> when they were dumb animals by Hyrulean classification. I'm getting the, um, the health potion back real quick. I think that would be a prudent idea before we uh, head on to... But well, we also need to get more money. Because we now we need the... Um... I heard that people uh, pulled over to the road and cried when they, they heard on the radio the... The revelation had been passed down that the Zoras were actually people and were allowed to go to heaven. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Zoras weren't people, so they all went to hell by default. Okay. I'm crazy Tracy. <laughs> I'm absolutely <laughs> insane! I know we have to... Unfortunately, it gave us the, br the bad RNG. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, the, 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 price, the price will change, oh, like... Basically, I don't know, depending on RNG, it'll either be 7, 28, or 42. Okay, so we got the worst one. So we got the worst one. She's in a, in a, in a spending mood. Yeah, and... Uh, so we delivered our own sort of subliminal gist to Richard here by doing the thing, but then going and getting rubbed by Crazy Tracy before going to see. Yeah, well, I, important. I also need money because we need to get that... Um, that shovel, and I'm not going to steal from the shop. Because I'm not going to go through the whole game with everyone referring to me as Steve. It would be cool if you were playing like a German version of the game, though, and it was like, you're dirty. <laughs> <laughs> I only know that because of c Live 2021. Um, because the Martian Law episode is actually called Dirty, which is German for the thief. Did we go down there already? I can't remember no, if we did or not. I don't think we did. Because we didn't have the power brace. Oh my god, stairs! <laughs> Alright, so here's where the Mad Batter is. is the, he's not called Mad Batter anymore? He's called the Bad Matter. <laughs> What's he called? No, really. Um, he's called Lil Devil. Lil Devil! Aww. Oh, hey, kid. It's always cute when you add Lil to things. <laughs> it's like what we call we call the, the Switch light. we call it Lil Switch. The Lil Switch. Also a piece of crap, but... Yeah. Um, hey, kid, you woke me up from a fine nap. Thanks a lot. Now I'll get my revenge. Oh, no. Are you ready? I'll let you carry more magic powder. Uh, no. Because I'd rather have... have let, let us carry more bombs. Because our bomb co uh, total, uh, our bomb carrying capacity is up to thirty right now. Okay. Now it's sixty. Yeah. We have more bombs than we'll ever, and it also fills us up to max. Oh no! Please save us from all the bombs. Now look at all that junk you have to carry. Oh, well, I can't be mad at you, little devil. You're so cute with your little. It's like how manslaughter is little murder. <laughs> little manslaughter. <laughs> little murder. <laughs> little murder. <laughs> Um, we can get a few other things while we're here. We're, it's not, it's not really exploring, because I know where every, where all the original stuff is, but... We can, we can continue we on. Can, we can do this. We can get this, because, um, heart pieces are very important in, uh, in a run where you can't heal yourself. Yes. Quite. Uh... 
Uh, except when you mess up the block puzzle, that's, uh, I think you have to go in the other way. I think, yeah, I think you have to. I'm like, I was looking at him, like, I don't think you can solve it from that side. Oh, we can get another code stole while we're here, too. I mean, it's not going to do anything. Save me, please! If, if <laughs> for any reason we run out of magic powder, now we can just get more for free. I'm covered in sand! <laughs> pocket sand. We do have pocket sand. In case we run out of pocket sand, we use a mushroom to get more. So now we have 60 bombs. Uh, which is more bombs than I think we'll ever need, but, uh, you know, who knows. The Dodongo Worms are actually a lot more of a pain in the ass than this. Uh, not from a standpoint of they'll murder us, but from a standpoint of they're very, very seldom vulnerable. They're less vulnerable than they were, like, in the original. Fair enough. I don't know if you remember what the Dodongo Worms were, but uh, we'll see them in the next dungeon. I'm not really remembering. Oh, yeah, yeah, they're the... Oh, they're gross-looking. Oh, they're yeah, like they're... the long black bulbs that have like the, yep. the gaping, uh, 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 I'm a Dodongo worm. Yeah. yeah, yeah, they look even... I'm Australian too for some reason. They're, they're, they're looking worse now. <laughs> or even more gross, I would say. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, not nice. Oh. Ah, it's clinging to my face. I'm gonna, okay. get, a, gonna get a lesion. <laughs> I'm nauseous. I'm nauseous. And you got a secret seashell. And now it says that there could be something in it for you if you collect a lot of them. Because, yes, because we... now you've been there and you know. And knowing is half the battle. You canonically know the secret of the secret seashells. Did we go down here already? It's like that book, The Secret, except the secret seashells actually can change your life. Yes, we did go down here. We okay. did go down here. Now it's just an empty well. It's a convenient place to put bodies, though. <laughs> Not that we would need to do no, that. No, of course not. This isn't the creepy pasta version of Link's Awakening. Why would you think that? What, what, is... Wait, wait. Is that is that is that village music playing backwards all of a sudden? <laughs> is there a creepy pasta? Are version those photorealistic versions of my family? Okay, there's no new prizes there. I haven't read any, but I'm sure, considering how like strange this game is, that there's plenty of creepy pasta. Well, if there weren't before, there are now that the uh, that the uh, remake was hyped up so much. Oh yeah, I'm sure. And it's I mean, this is like a game a... where, like, the guy, like, calls you a thief and murders you. Well, yeah. Like, I'm sure there's, like, somebody has written some weird shit about, like, it changed the name of the game to my actual name and told me that, uh, you know... Now I'll pay the ultimate price. Yes. That's what he says when he kills you. And then he, he shot me with lasers and a pair of sunglasses emerged from the ceiling and landed on his eyes, and it said Still the Best 1992. <laughs> he, shot, he shot my character with the lasers, but I could feel the lasers for real. <laughs> <laughs> there were sprites that couldn't even be rendered on the Game Boy. It was in full color in 3D. It was so weird. It looked like the Switch version, which you should buy right now. Oh, that'd be great if Nintendo just started... If Nintendo, after going after the ROM sites and having them closed down, if Nintendo went after the Creepypasta sites <laughs> just, and started all... forcing them to put, like, advertisements in their Creepypasta... <laughs> the photorealistic skeletons <laughs> of my family reached out of the screen and said, Buy the Switch version of Link's Awakening! Link's Awakening Creepypasta by G. Bowser. <laughs> <Are you ready? laughs> he said, Are you ready for Demon X Machina on October? Over 26. <laughs> I don't know when Demon X Machina actually comes out. I, I don't know. Is, is it out? I, I think, think it's it out already. Yeah. Out. yeah. The only thing I remember about it is like I'm not really interested. It, it, I got I get confused with Astral Chain a lot. Yeah. Um, Astral Chain is the one that I I do have on my radar. I'm not, not, not going to get it right away. I'll get it like when I'm done with my. There's a shitload of good games coming out. On the but Demon X Machina has the. Um, has the has the special uh, Joy Cons for it. I mean, they can work with anything, and they look better than regular and Joy Cons. I want cons. some controllers that actually work. So, yeah. Uh, you can get one of these. Yeah. Uh, I have the Switch Pro controller. Does, so I can does that, that work? The TV? Yeah. Work it doesn't okay. work. It doesn't really work in handheld mode. Oh yeah, this isn't working. Well, I mean, this can work in handheld mode. It, 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 it works in kickstand mode. It's not the Joy Con. It looks like it's like an actual controller controller. Yeah. Um, so that's fine for like the TV. I mean, it's just not getting hit by stuff. Yeah, you should probably like avoid damage when possible. That's uh, it's a lot of damage. <laughs> It's kind of a tall order. I'm 
just kind of trying to get... Oh, I know where I can get some money. Not by getting shot back. Nope. But now I've got to spend some money. Oh, and I can get into the fairy spot real quick. Let's, I was about to say, I, was gonna, I need to buy some hearts from the shop now. Now I've just got to... I can just... Ugh. I don't want to waste my the medicine I just bought. Oh, yeah. So much money goes into keeping myself alive, and it doesn't even work. It's like time. real life! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Just like real life. Yeah, there's, uh, like, the astral chain thing. I, I got confused the other day. I actually got confused in the conversation on Discord because there's that game that came out earlier in the year called The Outer Wilds. And there's that, that game that's coming out, like, early next year that Obsidian is making called The Outer Worlds. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, which one of these is which again? Which one is the indie game and which is the one that's, like, Fallout but made by Obsidian? And sold out to Epic? Mm. Both of them are sold out to Epic, from oh, what I understand. Because okay. the Outer Wilds is only on uh, the Epic Store, too. Everybody's getting that Epic money. Well, you heard... Um, what the fuck was it? It was... I, I cannot remember the exact figure. I want to say it was $17 million. But did you see the thing where... Uh, Apparently, it, it came out that Epic paid se uh, paid uh, Remedy Games seventeen million dollars to have control as a uh, ex Epic Store exclusive on the PC. No, like that's nuts. Like, make that money, Remedy. Go for it. Give us another Alan Wake. Uh, there we go. We can jump right over that. But good so lord, like, Epic has so much money to throw around. Now we can get that one. And that should have enough to get us a shovel. I mean, that's what happens when you have the second biggest game in the world, I guess. Yep. It's probably not even... Fortnite probably isn't even the second biggest game in the world. I know League of Legends is still the biggest game in the world. Yeah. With like 150 yes. million people a month. I don't, I don't keep track of that stuff. It's kind of insane when you think about it. I wish I could use warp points. I mean, I can use warp points, but just I can't use it. I can't use them like the easy way until later. And I keep expecting there to be like something here that'll take me back to Marin and Terran's house, but this isn't the randomizer. Ah. <laughs> oh, woe be unto us if it was, though. <laughs> if this was a randomizer, I would not be playing in hero mode. Oh hell! I wouldn't no. be able to heal myself. You need a hero. Someone to rescue you. <laughs> Don't run away, I will. Aesthetic. Wah, wah, wah. Well, you should start doing like a like a pink filter over the screen. <laughs> it starts to like turn. There's like some columns behind us and like a big like Roman bust. <laughs> we should do one of these days. I should do, just put it right between like a big ass like like Macintosh Plus bust like right between us. I was and not comment on it the entire video. Something I've been I've been I've been thinking. I mean, I I, I, I know I always say this, but like um. One of the visions that I've had for like our setup here is to, 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 be, to be uh, put like a table back here. Yeah. And just kind of like put stuff like on one on my side there'd be like stuff that pertains to my interests, and on the other side stuff that pertains to your interests. Okay. But if you just want a big Roman bust, that's fine too. <laughs> it would be like mine with a be, pink background it would and be like, checkerboard. It would and... be a Roman bust. It would be like a, a marble head. And, like, a framed photograph of, like, Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> and, like, the painting from Men. <laughs> it would be all very tasteful. No, you know what? It would be, you know what would be behind me on the table would be a picture of me doing the LP with a picture on the table <laughs> of a picture of me on the couch of a picture of me on the table. Yes. It would be recursive. It'd be a recursive... Like that shirt you have. A recursive Let's Play. What? I don't think I have that shirt anymore. That shirt hasn't fit me in a while. Ah, très bien. <laughs> I see you have recovered all of the leaves. Now, move this statue, and you will find your reward. I'm not going to move it. That's for Enrique to do. That's for peasants to do with their hands. It's a, it's a frog statue now. It's not just a box. Oh, that's nice. And it's the pit where I keep all my bodies. And the Zima. Oh, why did I was, jump? <laughs> that was a good move. <laughs> but then it, was, it didn't work. 
It was a good try, though. I was really impressed when you just leapt right over. I'm like, nice. I, I actually didn't mean to do that. I thought I was pushing the B button. I was pushing Y. <laughs> That's a fast roll. Go on. Pockets. Pocket sand. Oh. There we go. So I have the R button. The R button is shield now. The shield is always equipped. I should be using it more. This is also true. And it takes us to... So our reward is to be taken to his overgrown bed. Wonderful. My day is ruined. My disappointment is immeasurable. An octopus, uh, octopus garden in the shade. Is that how that line goes? I, I don't know. You're the Beatles fan. I think so. I'd like to, I'd like to be under the sea. Yeah. <laughs> And so you'll sleep secrets beneath your souls. That means dig here. Yes, dig here, dummy. Okay. And there's the key to Tail Cave. It's the uh, key cavern. Slime key. Yes, you're right. Uh, my bad. To uh, Tail Cave. To Walnut Woods. Yeah. I'm gonna. That's something I, I want to want to do. Like have a bonus thing where I make a dungeon, and then have you do the dungeon. Oh, okay, cool. I thought you were going to say it's... You said Walnut. I thought it was going to be like some sort of like Sopranos-themed dungeon that you want to do. Oh, no, that was, that was... It was... Like, there's a room where, like, you throw a chair at ghosts. Um, How do you get across that? I shouldn't need the Pegasus boots. I've been able to do it without them. But, um... I'm just going to play it safe and, uh... Come back later. Okay. Uh, I'm also going to go, and I'm going to unlock the, um... Yeah, that's another thing, new thing now. They put a, uh, a rock there so you can just jump out. Nice. You don't have to work your way back. Let's open this up. Hey, do you think they see us? <laughs> yeah. Meh. Nah. And then quickly go heal myself. I would not like to have two hearts going into this dungeon. Please and thank you. That would be funny, though. It would be, but I, I'm, and what is the, I'm in it to win it. What is the point of hero mode if not to torture you? Look, I, I understand this is supposed to be a challenge, but at the same time, I'm going to adapt myself to making the challenge as, as not hard on me as possible. It's fair. For the sake of my own sanity. No, I get that. You want it to be challenging, but not too challenging. You know, fun fact, Ukuku is the same forwards Shit. and backwards. Not sure. No, I, I, I got hit on the way over. I lost a heart. No, I know. See, I saw that. Instead, instead of losing frames, we're losing hearts. <laughs> That's a lot of lost hearts there. I had the Pegasus boots. Oh, you could save so much time with those boots. Yeah. When do we get those? We get those in this we one? We get those in this dungeon, yes. Good. And um, the coolest thing is that they're actually attached to their own button, too. The coolest thing is that they fit us. <laughs> yeah, they've been hanging around a dungeon. You wouldn't think they fit us. Excuse me, guys. I'm just going in here real quick. Bye. <laughs> These boots are mine. They were made for me. <laughs> 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 This is my cavern. All right, I have to the use... enigma of key cavern. You see, they actually with these with these uh, with these doors, they actually put a pot on them now. Oh, to make it more obvious that you. Yeah, you freaking idiot. That's how I. That's how I do everything. You know, I put a picture of it of the thing that smashes us. We're going to the right later. Um, this is gonna suck because these bomb enemies are suck. <laughs> that is tautologically sound. <laughs> This will suck because they are suck. Because of that. That's pretty much why they suck. Oh my goodness. They can hit you multiple times and then explode on you. Ah. So I'd like to avoid that if possible. They go crazy on you. <laughs> crazy on you. You got a sparky. <laughs> and pizza power. <laughs> Welcome to the Chuck E. Cheese dungeon. Here's your pizza oh, power. Oh, oh, it's a bad! It's a bad! <laughs> this is a 
<laughs> Mommy, they put a bat in the chest. <laughs> the chest is sharp again. <laughs> the chest is sharp again. <laughs> Take the chest back to the Northwest Territory. Get out of my way. Stay out of my territory. I know technically I could just go up, but... You might as well jump. I s go ahead and jump. This is just how I play the game. You, hey, you know, you're the one with the controller. Doing the LP, not me. It's not I like don't... I'm not, I, we're not... You're doing this so much more efficiently than I would be doing, so... You got a special acorn. Would be. Well, no, the acorn is good because I take half damage. The acorn is no. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna, gonna do, do a Zardoz. I'm not gonna do a Zardoz because that requires me to say bad words. <laughs> I'm family friendly. Now, welcome to ABC Family's <laughs> walkthrough of Link's Awakening, <laughs> starring starring Jessica Biel and everyone else who was on Seventh Heaven in the '90s. Uh, I gotta kind of com commit to getting this guy because I need the key now. You know what? I would watch a YouTube Let's Play that was done by Pat Ryan. Why? <laughs> <laughs> because it would be odd and entertaining. This this little fella here is tell possessed by the devil. He's teleporting <laughs> back and forth. I fi I figured he'd be playing something more like Bible Adventures, but uh, uh, oh, I like don't that, know. Sh that shitty game that's like the reskin of Doom, except you have like a Bible instead of a. Oh gun. no, that's Super Noah's Ark 3D. Oh, um, okay. See, you know better than I do. Same same company made that though. Made it. But, uh, Wisdom um, Tree. Wisdom right? Tree. Yeah. Uh, no, they made. Uh, Good lord, this guy is invincible. Um, he's not invincible, he's just very fast and teleports, and the easiest way to kill him is if you have the Pegasus boots, which we don't. Um, you could put a bomb down on both spots, then he'd be fucked. Well, I can't because the floor moves. Whoa. Wow, that was the wrong button. <laughs> um, another easy way to kill him is if you have the magic rod, as I've learned in randomizers, but... Uh, we don't get the magic rod until like near the end of the game, so no thank you. I would not like to subscribe to your newsletter. <laughs> Actually <Yeah>. Damn it! <laughs> alright, yeah, alright, alright. Let me try like The male of the species is completely Yeah, hold on to it for a second. Let it get Uh it nice doesn't no 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 the, the fuse doesn't doesn't go when I hold it. What the shit? That is Garbaggio. <laughs> Garbaggio. Put it. Hang on. Put it. See the one there. That. Yeah. Put it that one. Put it on that. Just put it on that one. So and that'll push it. it over. Oh shit. And then down. Yeah. Move them back onto the thing. Then toss it onto that one that goes to the left. Not into the. Well, that might work. Yes. Well, now he's over there. I'm still here. I'm and still now, here, and you. Now, how how come all of a sudden I'm like throwing them like 50 feet? Thank God you've got 60 of them. Yeah, really. <laughs> this is problematic. <laughs> um, no, there's no like racist or sexist content in this. I mean, unless I put something there, which I will not, because. <laughs> I am as American and wholesome as, I'm as wholesome as America's Funniest Home Videos. As World News Tonight with Dan Rather. As Gerard the Completionist. No, he swears. I'm as American as Gerard Depardieu. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah, get that key before it goes down the hole. Alright, so that was completely much, you made that much harder than it had to be. Now I'm making it harder. Oh, shit. No. Oh, loving duck noodles. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was. Now I wasn't. I wish I wasn't using rush titles for the titles for the video. <laughs> oh, shooting duck noodles. <laughs> <laughs> that'll be that'll be the description. Oh, shooting duck noodles. <laughs> there we go. You know, you would think that the, the the conveyor belts would send it if you push them down into the thing. What are they even supposed to be? Magic. 
They're it's magic. <laughs> they're conveyor belts. No, not the conveyor belts. The enemies. What the hell? They have giant feet, <laughs> and they're are they like birds? Are they supposed to be? What the hell are they? Um, they're unnerving, is what they are. They, <laughs> they look a lot less creepier than they do in the uh, Game Boy one. See, no mouth that suck on that pounding sixteen penny nails. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, there we no no don't fall. Kill the thing. Kill the the weeble. <laughs> it wobbles, but it never falls unless you hit it with a fucking bomb. There we go. What? <laughs> Damn it, my brilliant man to hide. <laughs> yeah, don't let that key fall. Okay. <sighs> well, still, you have Uno, Uno Corazon. Well, I, I still have, like, the medicine and I have a fairy. Oh, yeah, you have the big staple rub. You got the Dapper Dan. Yeah, that's what we need to be calling it, the Dapper Dan. Yes. Oh! He broke your guard. Unfortunately for you, sir, I'm a Dapper Dan man. Boink. And we're going to hit this crystal switch. This is going to uh, get us access to a couple of chests down here. Ah, excellent. Oh, yeah, there it is. Yep. It's not going to be deep. <laughs> it's spring break with the bee. Spring bee. Smoke up the spring bee in Miami. Bee. <laughs> <laughs> it's like uh, there's like a, like topless women dancing around, and like people are like shotgunning beers. And, and Pitbull is there for some reason. <laughs> And it's all run by like a giant stone owl. <laughs> it's, it's like Spring Breakers as directed by David Lynch, essentially. <laughs> Whenever someone tries to make sense of what's going on, you just put the air horn in their face and go, Arr, 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 Arr. <laughs> This is the worst adaptation of Harrison Bergeron I've ever seen. Okay, we don't have to kill this one. Oh no, he lives. <laughs> he is Sinistar. <laughs> Thou shalt not suffer of whatever that thing is to live. <laughs> oh good. Oh excellent. And that's a key key. Oh, we're almost to the dongo worms. Oh god, what do they look like? Well... Do they look like the things they look like? They look like the things they look like. And now we're back on... No, we're, we're, back on the, we're on the attack now. We're back on our bullshit. Except we can also run a little faster. Jump a little higher. Maybe a little bit. Uh... They got these green-colored bombs. Are a bit more... Jerks. Oh, yeah, these guys! Oh, they've got the little numbers and everything. It's a... adorable? It's, it's a cute a bowl. <laughs> it's a cute, like a, like an inflamed appendix. Or a, an angle that's less than 100 degrees. An angle that's less than 90 degrees. There you go. Compass. And, of course, once we can get out of the text boxes. <laughs> Oh, I made that joke already. I was going to say, God, home will tell you if the key is nearby, if it is anywhere in the game world. <laughs> yes! Blow up your friends! Do it. Head <laughs> to the dark side. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I'm just, just picturing the bombs going after the younglings now. <laughs> Master Bob Bob, what's going on out there? Oh god. I don't know I don't know if they're supposed to be Bob Bombs, but um they uh 
they very vaguely resemble them. It's not like the Goombas and the Spinies and such. Oh, that's oh, that's, that's, that's the time. I'm just gonna kill this guy real quick, and um, when we come back, that Led um, Zeppelin riff was to let you know that our time here has ended. So let me just get this guy off here. <laughs> and uh, when we come back, the Dongo Worms. The Dongo Worms. So until... I'm sorry, you have to wait another video to see the Dongo Worms. <laughs> so I know you're like, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> so until then, I've been Captain Floofers. and I'm Solo Greg. We'll be here next time. Join us, won't you?